The following contest is a table, ladders, and chairs match. Making his way to the ring from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 220 pounds, Young Blood. We have one-on-one -on -one action on the way, and this one should be nothing short of amazing. I don't doubt that for a moment, Michael. In fact, I would go so far as to say this match might just steal the show. And on top of that, this match will undoubtedly have a big impact on where these guys stand in the next WWE.com power rankings. And there's been so much upward movement from new faces over the past few weeks that dropping more than 10 spots following a loss isn't necessarily out of the question. And we're ready to go here with this huge TLC match. It always amazes me the amount of punishment these competitors are willing to go through in order to win a TLC match. This crowd here in Miami can barely contain themselves, and I can't say that I blame them. This is going to be great. In your opinion, what is S thinking about at this point? So what can these WWE fans expect out of him tonight? It's obvious. Just look at the ringside area. It shouldn't come as a surprise to anyone that the likelihood of a competitor getting seriously injured skyrockets once they're confirmed to compete in a TLC match. I know it's hard, but he needs to keep his composure here and make sure every step is measured. Things can change in there in a heartbeat. Nice. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no count outs. Plenty of force behind that strike. Strikes like that can end this one in a hurry. He misses there. You just can't miss by that much, Cole. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. Inside the ring now. Ain't no stopping him now. And there's the elbow. He gets him with a reversal. And a savage clothesline. is DDT! That has got to be it. That'll knock you loopy, Cole. A thunderous elbow shot. Flips the script on him there. 
Oh, and he's one step ahead on that one. He put some mustard on that one. Taking it to the back now. Oh, the counter. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. starting to stagger a bit. I don't think he expected to be in this position here. This is par for the course, fellas. As we all know, a TLC match is among the most dangerous matches in all of WWE. You're going to get hurt when you compete in one. There's just no way around it. Hey, sometimes when the only person you respect is yourself, you don't really care how much you hurt your opponent. And I can't help but get the feeling that he's out to hurt somebody tonight. Miami, Florida playing host to us tonight. As you may recall, it was WrestleMania 28 that emanated from right here in Miami. And now one more time. Momentum's firmly in his corner now. Here's his moment, Michael. And he gets him with the counter. There may be no escaping this fireman's carry. I don't know. Never say never, Cole. Gravity taking over there. Dodges a bullet there. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Showing very few signs of life here. Yeah, there's no way he comes back from this. Might as well ring the bell now. <laughs> Things are obviously looking good right now, but let me tell you, climbing that ladder at this point in the match is no easy task. Man, that got him good. He landed a perfectly placed strike. That'll send a message to your adversary, all right. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Just making his presence felt there. He's simply reminding him that he's here. It's matches like this that have been exciting the WWE Universe all over the globe, particularly here in Miami tonight. He is a one-man gang in there. He's not looking good here, Byron. No, he's got to get up, and he's got to get up now. The tension, the drama, this is electric. And he lands a nice counter. I understand the idea of being relentless, but I think most would agree repeating a specific move is an unorthodox approach. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. Oh, and he reverses it. He's taking a lot of punishment. If it continues, it could eventually affect his vision. Man, this is one of those matches you just like to sit back and...
People have been wanting to see these guys go at it for a long time, and by the sound of this crowd, I think they're getting what they wanted. Miami, Florida playing host to us tonight. As you may recall, it was WrestleMania 28 that emanated from right here in Miami. He's looking a little off balance. I'm not sure how much more he has to give. I talked to those close to him earlier today, and every single one of them said he was prepared to take this TLC match. At this point, though, he may need a minor miracle for that to happen. Sorry, guys, but I just can't find a way to get excited. That's it. It's over. It's over. But can he follow up here? Just a matter of time now before this superstar goes for the finisher. And when that happens, you can bet this one's over. What a hellaciously physical match these gladiators have put themselves through. The intensity of this has been incredible. Got it. Michael, that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Again, the sledgehammer lands. This is getting out of hand, guys. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. There may be no coming back from this incredible beatdown. And now he goes for it a second time. Direct hit. No question about that one. Here we go again. These superstars have tried everything. They have something left in their arsenal. They have to, but can they dig down deep enough to find it? Keep in mind, this superstar is competing hurt tonight. Or so we're told. I'm not so sure I believe it. Here he goes. And he lands the slam. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? If I hear one more person tell me about how brave this superstar is for competing injured, I'm going to lose my mind. I mean, what we're talking about here is essentially the equivalent of a hangnail. I wouldn't necessarily call that an injury. This singles contest has a victor. Here is your winner, Youngblood. Quite some back and forth there before finally picking up the win. That was simply...